another episode of more to the story bam, 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 bam. i am farron moore i'm to hear more you already know what it is the real is in the building it is goddamn all right she cut him off <laughs> <laughs> it makes no sense when he does that um i'm very excited to introduce our guests here how you guys is that we have no. That's a very excited <laughs> voice. I just no. want everybody to know. Hi. I'm so excited. How you guys? Um, no, we have. Oh, I can't. Oh, I was about to mess up his name because he got, changes got, it every three, every three years. Every three years, he has another name. Ladies and gentlemen, we got uh, comedian extraordinary. We got extra, a comedian extraordinary writer, actor, comedian, director, <laughs> producer of content and Why number of game to? shows because you were stalling. <laughs> I wasn't in the middle stolen. Of traffic. Ladies and gentlemen, we have CT in the oh, building. Bye, 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 bye. And CT. to his left, we have his beautiful, talented wife. She's a writer. She's an actor. She's a stand-up comedian <gasps> and host. You done? What are you saying <laughs> through my intro? What I do? Because I'm offended. You won't let me do it. <laughs> anyway, ladies and gentlemen, make some noise. We got Tangerine Martin Thomas in the building. Bye, 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 bye. See, I wouldn't have done that. Yes, if it was me, I wouldn't have done that. You would have known you, my last name is Thomas. I would have known. No, she wouldn't. If he had, she me. ain't even took it my last name. It drives him crazy how slow I, I go. She's still fair and brown? She's still fair and no, brown. She's, no, she's fair and more. The, she right. changed it online. I, I saw am. it change. Wait a minute. I saw it change. And that's Let how me you see really ID. make it official. Let me wow. see your ID, though, sis. No. <laughs> no, the ID, the ID <laughs> says what the ID says. Is what, is <laughs> Thank you for say. the orange hearts and <laughs> the, the orange uh, tangerine emojis. I actually so, didn't change mine legally for, until we were five years in. I was like, okay. I think, <laughs> I think I like this guy. I go I ahead I like and do it. Guy. I think I like this guy. I was actually going to do it for, wasn't that our fifth year anniversary? See? I was going to, but then he um, decided to book a trip to London. Mm. And I needed my passport before I could get my name changed. Mm. Yeah. And so it, that became the priority. And then it just fell to the back burner. Yeah, yeah, so. Yeah. Same I'm stuff going, happened over here. Yo, yeah, I'm, my, my passport still has my last name up there. So here, mm -hmm. can you just do the fair and impression one time right now? <laughs> <laughs> Which one? The one that from the joke or like a normal one? Give me both. All right. <laughs> hey guys. <laughs> so much for coming to another episode. I do of... not sound like that. You so dramatic. And why do I have a list? I don't know. I always give everybody a list. Now give me the give me the from the <laughs> joke. Listen. Babe! What the? No, what are you doing now? You got, hold on, stay, stay right there, babe. I'm, I'm, I, 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 I need to talk to you, but I'm, I'm scared. She's special need. Is this when she's intoxicated? No, no, this is when she wanted to tell me that she had quit her job. I wanted to tell him something very uh, important, but she hadn't told me that she had quit her job. So. Yes, I was trying to smooth smooth it out before I took it to him. Mm -hmm. I was like, oh my god, I did that. Congratulations. Yes, Big step. thank you. Sweat. It's starting all over every time I think about it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's going to be good. It's triggering. Um, okay, so y'all, we start the show with um, conversation, conversation cards. Conversation cards. Mm. Yes, yes, yes. And so um, this is from the Best Self. Um, I've used them on here before. Best Self Intimacy Deck. And That's Deck. Deck. Hey, Not dick. That's dick. <laughs> Intimacy <laughs> deck. But this show, it could turn into dick. Let's that's see. how they go. This show goes hard. You that's, don't know. No. <laughs> yeah, it does. It does. Yeah, we do. It does. <laughs> um, so, I have pulled one card from each of the categories. So, everybody can pick a card. You choose who answers your question. But once a person has answered, they cannot be asked. You choose who again. answers your question. Okay. Yes. Even if it's you, you can even choose yourself if you. Okay. Okay. But once, but it, okay. once you've answered a question, you cannot be chosen again. Okay. Do I ask first and then choose the person to answer it? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Catch them off guard. All right, Tanj. Oh, that yellow one is calling me, so I'm going to go Why don't you go to orange? Because it looked reddish. Oh, well, that's a good point. <laughs> All right, we'll go. Bam. Oh, this is safe. <clears throat> She said, this is safe. Yeah. Uh, I already know the answer to this. And it's inappropriate. <laughs> that's my baby. I'm, that's my baby. You talking about you know your answer or you yeah, know, know what the, anybody would answer? Oh, okay. I know this answer if I ask Tangerine 
And um, I'm like, it's inappropriate to ask anybody else. So I'm like, right. nah, we love the inappropriate <laughs> shit. Yes, 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 yes. Come with it, my baby. Don't shy oh, away, my friend. Come on with it, my baby. So who's first? Um, we go to our left start, right. Yeah. Oh, nice. Tangerine, you first. So I read my question, then I decide who's going to answer it. Mm-hmm. Oh, you can just answer it. Tell me about the family you imagined creating when you were little. That's such a sweet question. Mm. I was not expecting something so sweet. That's what. <laughs> can we pull a new card? I want something about dick and balls. Oh, my God. <laughs> okay. Well, this is the wrong deck of I'm cards, sorry. then. I was just going <laughs> to... I can answer halfway to let somebody else answer with a more interesting question. I, I, was, I thought I was going to have a set of twin boys... And be uh, married to uh, probably an Omega because I was gonna be a Delta, and we was gonna work out together and probably travel the world, and I was never gonna be in the same city uh, twice or something like that. So I'm kind of mm-hmm. getting the travel part. Three out of five, amen. And uh, the yep. money we got the money because we didn't have the kids, so we can do it. There you go. Right. Nice, nice. Quiet as kept though. I wanted to be, I wanted to be a uh, assassin. Oh, oh, I'd be in the FBI. Yeah, FBI like, agent. He told me I that. wanted to do that because I wanted to move around a lot. I didn't want to have roots any anywhere. roots anywhere, mm. but also didn't want to have any family, so I okay, made Kanye. them a target. So mm. I was just like... You thought this through. I really thought this through. I was like, I could do this and not feel bad. Especially I if I know that. it's like for a good cause. Like If I'm taking out like drug lords, kingpins, and stuff like that, a mile away, obviously not a mile away, but like two buildings away on a rooftop, been laying there for eight hours just for them to come to the bathroom and and then that's my day. You've always been evil. You be a I great say, FBI I would... agent, but an assassin, I don't know. You're very easily um, spotable. Because he likes skin? Not just it's that. It's like the hate. freckles and the I'd be hair. a master of disguise. The fuck are you talking about, lady? <laughs> mm. I have Farron. all type of prosthetics Farron is the shit, master man. of disguise. Oh, yeah, man. <laughs> okay. Fuck you, man. You didn't say anything about a prosthetics first. I mean, I wouldn't. Nobody's just gonna be going out just regularly doing that you shit. I got freckles. I would on stand out in India. No, I didn't. <laughs> this shit conversation on in India. is ridiculous. <laughs> anyway, uh, man, you go next. Okay. Um. <laughs> oh wait, I'm sorry. <laughs> just your athletic ability. <laughs> Are you shitting on his dreams next? <laughs> I'm sorry to hear. The, I just. I'm sorry. I just this. could not think. I would not consider assassin. And that's why you be dead. Because <laughs> <laughs> no one would expect me. I, I, like, I've true, always I, had a different level. Like, yeah, you know, I would be selling like weed and crack in a briefcase. Because nobody's going to expect the nigga with the briefcase to have the weed and the crack on him. He just gave all the drug dealers out there Brilliant the perfect idea. cover for yourselves. Yes. You're welcome, niggas. But don't be in a jersey in a briefcase. That yeah, yeah, yeah. You got to look the part. You got to look the part. Yeah. You got a jersey on and a throwback hat so with a briefcase. <laughs> Selling dope. Um, okay. What first attracted you to me? Well, I uh, remember. Yes, that this we is were definitely a to hear question. In the we were at the comedy <laughs> union and I was like, that nigga caked up. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Both of y'all are caked up on the low. Oh, right? You want to talk about ain't no it? Low. Ain't no ain't low. Y'all got There's way no more low ass than your wife. No Listen, I saw it. If I like, if I drop something, when I squat down, you hear beep. <laughs> <laughs> I tell him all day. I'm looking at your booty all day. Oh. She just be I'm looking at your booty. I'm not allowed to admit when I look at his because he doesn't like that it's Don't so like big. It all. So I can't say oh, it. So I probably really triggered you. Just you now. definitely triggered me. So <laughs> tell him what tell happened, Farron. Yeah. <laughs> So I'm just standing there, minding my own business, and my eye caught Clayton's booty. (laughs) And um, I told him I wanted to touch it, and his wife said I could. Yes. First of all, she holds no dominion over me. (laughs) Well, it works. It works. Dominion over me. But think about it. If you had said I could and she didn't co-sign it, I wouldn't have done it. Thank you, sis. (laughs) Appreciate the respect. So... It's nice, though, babe. I don't... Anyway, man, this is something I've dealt with my entire life. Um, I know the problem. You know, I, mean, I, know, I, know, I, know I know the feeling, Big brother. or small, you get that. And women have told me different things my whole life, and it's very it's very off-putting, man. You don't, you don't know how to receive that. <laughs> you never that. get used to it? No. Oh, wow. Because it'll always catch you off guard. You think you're wearing some pants that nobody can notice. And then nah, a girl bro. come out of nowhere How and be like, oh, look at your butt. And you're like, oh, my you God. Let that go. I mean, that I'm sure you've seen a woman's butt and been like, no matter what she wears, she can't hide she that. Like, yeah. uh, all right. Thank yeah. you, guys. 
appreciate this oh. for my self esteem. So we took a picture together, and I put my hand on the small of his back and slowly moved it lower. Twice. To finish the story. Twice. Yeah. Um, and I, I applauded it. The disrespect <laughs> from everybody involved is crazy. <laughs> You have a nice ass, baby. All right. Let's I go love to the next. sweet voice. Like, it's going to soften it. <laughs> yes. As I caress his thighs. <laughs> the sweet voice. Oh. He actually has really great legs. Like, his bottom half is so oh, my legs are incredible. muscular. If you knew my leg strength, like, it's if, crazy. You just, like, if you touch my thighs, like, you just did my thighs, my quads, my calves yes. are as solid as a rock. Kick the shit um, out of me if he gets mad. Yeah. But, you <laughs> so know, he just work on the jack you across the room. <laughs> it's crazy. It's, it's crazy. abusive. It's abusive. <laughs> Clayton to get mad. He looks like one of them um, angry kangaroos. <laughs> <laughs> angry kangaroos? I'm picturing that, but I've never seen one you before. You haven't seen the buff-ass like, <laughs> No. I did not expect to be so verbally accosted coming on oh, as a guest right. of yes. more than the story. Oh, thank you. <laughs> you got to unlock your phone, baby. Oh, I thought I had them. So to hear is working as we're shooting the, the you're Tear sending always us works. marketing okay, materials. Okay. I love I'm it. So always ready. works. I love it. I admire you, sir. I just try to make the most out of my time. (laughs) Man, you be working. It's still going to my computer, baby. Got it. Thank you, sir. Uh, So I'll send it to my phone. No worries. Oh, the picture. The picture of when you were accosted. Yeah, that's (laughs) what he just said. That's my proof (laughs) before we go to the police. (laughs) 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 File a claim. Everybody witness it here. We got oh proof. my god! So, <laughs> like, um, like y'all, who who's your question we posed go. to? Uh, well, obviously Tangerine. I mean, no. Her answer is what she always tells me is the first time that she saw me be funny was on stage, and that was the thing that attracted her to me um, as far as my talent. So my talent is the first thing that attracted her, and then personally, once she got to know me and be like, oh wow, you're not this arrogant whatever everybody thinks that I am. And that was the thing. How many mm-hmm. conversations did that take? Um, she told me pretty early on. Okay. Like, we were still in, like, year one. So keep in mind, we met in 08 doing radio. Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. we were just friends. We didn't start dating until 2010. But okay. in uh, okay. somewhere in 08, I saw him perform comedy, and I said, wow, you have the it factor. You're really going to be a star. Aww. I wasn't trying to date him. I was just letting him know that I saw that light in him and mm-hmm. that he was going to make it. Oh, but what okay. attracted to me and made me start dating him was something happened to him um, and he showed me his vulnerable side. And mm. I was like, oh, wow, this is a whole nother person than what I was doing. Because in radio, Fox on radio and Jamie Foxx, everybody's talking shit. Yeah. Everybody's like trying to, you know, look well, at me, look yeah. at me and flirt right, with me. Right. But he was vulnerable. And I was like, oh, he could be a good boyfriend. Aww. And I would be a great girlfriend to you. And I texted him <laughs> that during the show. I was like texting him on the air like, I would be a great girlfriend to you. And, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and I had, it was random. Wow. So she shot she her so shot. shot you right? <laughs> but... In her uh, in her defense, I had never heard that from a woman. Mm-hmm. Like a woman just say, "I would be a great girl." And well, let me let me um, explain that further. Mm-hmm. A lot of times, uh, there are women who don't approach men. There are women who are not um, vulnerable back with a man. And her saying, "I would be a great girlfriend," and you showed me that she was a giver. As mm-hmm. opposed to, I need you to do this for me and do that for me. And you got to take me here and you got to do this. Mm-hmm. So her saying, I would be a good girlfriend. And you showed that she would be an asset to my life instead of a liability. And I had never heard it said like that. And I was mm-hmm. like, what are you talking about? And she was like, uh, you know, and she had recognized the things in my life that she would be able to add something to. And she did that in uh, eight millions of spades. <laughs> yeah. But please don't think that I shot my shot first. He was interested in me when we met. So Absolutely. don't think that. that. Okay. That, yeah. So yeah. it was, I mean, a, right. it was I mean, an ongoing thing. I love and how I was she like, had to point that out. Because I was like, I want people to be in it. thirsty in yeah. this <laughs> I had options. Get it twisted. <laughs> and I was like, nah, we just friends. And then I was like, okay, he's You still cool. got options. You got mad options. Your DMs be on fire. Not oh. just the DMs, the text messages. To the real phone They got the direct line. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I love my baby. Piece. Thank you. I want the best. Want the best. Thank yeah. you. We're happy. happy. <laughs> Me and everybody else is very happy. So, thank you. Stop oh talking. Oh my God! Both of please <laughs> and uh, immediately. I just like being left alone, man. You know what I mean? <laughs> he likes to keep me happy, and that's why this works. That's why eight years is what. Twelve the, years, eight married, made fourteen 14. knowing you. All right. Let's, Eight married. Let's if you wanted to, to go show. through the history, we're, we're oh. guests. Oh, okay. we're guests. Oh. He wants his credit <laughs> for all the other years. Is matched. We're guests. Mm. Yeah. Right, go ahead, Baron. I'm sorry. Huh. Um, apologize about this. So this question, I'm going to let anybody answer it for if it's relevant to to you. Mm. So the question is, what do you feel you need to work on most in your relationship? 
Mm, say here, you go first, clearly. Ain't that a bitch. <laughs> Uh, what do I need oh, to right. work on? It needed to be him or me anyway because both of y'all answered one. Facts. Um, <laughs> I could always work on my patience. Mm. Uh, and part of that is just from, you know, working, 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 wanting things to just happen and having that same type of uh, energy in being a husband and being a father. And then if you put LA traffic with that mm. and then also just the... The the ebbs and flows and the hills and valleys of being in entertainment. It's just like, when is my time coming? When is my time coming? Mm-hmm. Uh, still having faith, though, that God is always going. He's still in the business of blessing. All the time. Um, but just just having that patience is sometimes difficult. Like, Farron sometimes will ask me something, and it might be like, she forgets stuff all the time. Like, it's just all notorious at forgetting shit. Like, I told her Literally all probably the time. four or five times I was hosting for David Arnold. And I was like, yeah, I got to do the David Arnold show. What you doing then? <laughs> uh, <laughs> that's literally, hilarious. Literally, we'll talk about the next day, the, the night before, and the next morning. She'll be like, what you got to do today? And they'll just be like, mm. And at oh. first I was like, are you trying to catch me in a lie? Uh, <laughs> what, the, what the fuck are you trying to do? And I hate that he thinks that because it's like, we I've never given you any reason to think that that's what I'm trying it's to true. do. <laughs> that's, that's very much true. Like you it's have just, no grounds to, to it's, validate that. It's just, it's just, I hate repeating myself and that's part of being... Mm. A young a young parent, when I had my kid at a very young age, I was very, I was a discipline. And even with our daughter now, I'm the discipline. And mm. I'm better now at, like, having an actual conversation with her and getting her side of a story versus mm. saying, do this, do this, do that. And I realized I was doing that because that's the way I was raised. Mm-hmm. So from being that way, uh, being a teacher mm-hmm. and having a short fuse with teachers, because I mean, students, because they act a fool in another teacher's class. You ain't doing that shit in my class. I heard that. And so I've always been a very, when it comes to education and certain things and communication, no nonsense type of person. Mm-hmm. And so I had to learn to adjust because everybody doesn't do it as militant right, as right, I right. am and as as structured as I am. Like even Farron, like she is getting, she uh, my baby's eons better than what she used to be when it comes to social media because she oh wasn't God. in that world, so she didn't yes. understand it. Yes. She didn't understand the structure of making a post before a certain amount of time and, and giving a call to action when a post when you're trying mm-hmm. to grow your fan base and posting. Just posting. Yeah, she wasn't yeah. posting. You know, so, she was not so posting. She, <laughs> I would post doing. like three times in the whole year. Like, yeah. that would be it, it. it bothered me, and I'm not sure why I was affected by it, but I was like, <laughs> there's nothing on her page. You said I'm just not interested. Bothered. I was like, why don't you post anything? You have a beautiful child. You have this beautiful yeah. web. Out here. I wasn't she was interested. A, you were I like, wasn't. I'm not no, interested. I was like, she oh, wasn't. Okay. And Farron has really Farron is one of those people that used to that always looks good. She it's not a look that she can't pull off. Mm. Yes. Hats, she looks so good in my shit. She's just like, I'm gonna take this now. Mm. And that used to frustrate me. It was like, niggas, let these niggas know I'm winning. The bus. <laughs> <laughs> I get the bus in this when I want to. Why the fuck ain't <laughs> you? But all right, fuck it, I digress. So my patience is definitely one thing that I can yes. work on. Yes, I feel like I've been put into your life to teach you patience because, mm. that, that could be because true. you that can't could be remember true. anything. I bring the drama. <laughs> <laughs> That's, That's a good balance. That's, That's a good balance. She knows it. She knows it. <laughs> and it's clearly working for you guys. That's yes. funny because I'm the one that keeps the calendar. So he'll ask me, "What do I have to do tomorrow? Mm. What did I? What did I say I was doing on the 30th?" And then I'll look and remind him. Yeah, my mm-hmm. memory is well, two things. One, my memory is for um, not important things like. Uh, guest stars on TV shows from the 90s that I run into. Like, hey, you were on an episode of the Jamie Foxx show (laughs) in the reunion. And it's like, uh, yeah, like that's what my memory is for. So Um, your memory is just wasted. Yeah, for useless information. Trivial information. You know what I mean? But it's incredible when it's incredible. And then second, to hear, I hear that about you guys' relationship and I applaud you for saying that. I think your big issue that you don't realize is you have a lot of you beat yourself up a lot. That's crazy. Nobody asked you though. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> just want to get that to you, man. That's what a good, right, a good friend does. That's you beat up. yourself up a lot, and I'd be like, man, don't beat yourself up. And you'd be like, man, I, I know, but it's just like you be beating yourself up. Like if you don't, somebody else is. You know what? I think that's mm-hmm. part of the. That's it's a still a survival mentality, <clears throat> and it's also like just getting all the weakness out of the body. If mm. I get all the weakness out of the body, nobody can expose me. Nobody can manipulate mm. me and that type of stuff. And so it's just come, it, it came from having my guard up from moving out at 14. Yeah. Because if I showed any weakness, somebody older, bigger, stronger, obviously mm. would take advantage of that. Mm. I was vulnerable. Facts. You know what I'm saying? I had literally no one to run to mm. and tell what might be going on. So like, that just came from like, I ain't doing this enough. I ain't doing this enough. Like even mm-hmm. with working out, like I know it takes, you know, six to eight weeks to see real changes. But I'm like, yo, fuck. If the shit ain't happening soon, I'm just gonna 
cancel, I'll, I'll cancel the, the trainer. And I I'll wish just our trainer knew how I am fighting for his life. <laughs> because I'm like, dude, you just, you just really started doing what you were supposed to do when you aren't in the gym. Mm-hmm. Like, you mm-hmm. just that's started doing was. that. Yeah, because that's like, what so it really helps. So you cannot blame results. this man right. for, you know, if it's not falling off. Mm-hmm. Because he is he's working doing the, he's the, the fuck out of us. Oh, yeah, he does the like, work. I just was, seriously. I'm just, I'm just, Fiscally responsible when it comes to like just sit, giving out cash. I'm like, mm-hmm. well, I ain't seeing no results. Then let's just cut this. <laughs> then that's <laughs> a you problem. It is. It is. And I miss that. So meanwhile, can you stand up and show everybody how fit you are in this tiny dress? I'm Farron? not gonna do that. Farron, but... you're working so hard. I'm so she's glad not, you. No, she's not working so hard. It just comes naturally to her. It falls off though because she had gained weight and then lost man. it. Yeah. It's like we switched. She has the metabolism of a nine year old. Because I, I can I can just start running. I don't even need to hit the gym hard. I can just start running and the weight would just fall off. If I may, what I was going to say before you said that to Farron was to hear, I actually see your results, brother. You're looking great, man. Thank you, brother. You know, I appreciate it. A lot and, of times oh, you keep giving it to the women, I'm telling you, I see. He, I what he's it. not saying is that he's been trying on stuff that he couldn't get into see? and it's so spitting, so baby. it's hey, there. Hey, about me. About me. <laughs> so it's there, it's just not a, in abundance, but it's there because he's now starting to do what he's supposed I to do. I saw him eating a salad when I got gym. here. I saw him eating yeah. a salad. Yeah. I like a lot of salads, I like salads. Yeah, uh, so now your question. You upset? No. <laughs> a little pouty over my, there. Got my business. <laughs> On a scale of one to ten, how comfortable are you with public displays of affection? I think we talked about this. Yes. We, talk, we talked about this on the uh, uh, um yeah the, the sex uh, show. Patreon thing. Yeah. But I'm getting you. I I am yeah. more uh, open to public displays of affection. Mm-hmm. I actually like it. I see people doing it. I'm like, you know. I don't mind doing that. Yeah, I, I want to hear you and that. Marcus talk about it because you yeah, know he I, don't like oh, it. Oh, yeah, he hates it. He hates it. <laughs> For me, and I told her that because she always wanted it, but because I never did it, she just thought that that would be something that she has to deal with in our marriage. Mm. Uh, but I never did it, not because I didn't want to do it or didn't like it or don't don't find it uh, uh, pleasing. It was because I didn't want people to see me out, mm-hmm. hugged up with my wife, kissy face, and I look like an easy target. So if I'm all oh. like this, walking hand in hand, smiles yeah. and shit like that, Get him. like this nigga, right. oh, this nigga ain't don't forget my baby. Oh, been, that's the St. Louis. Yeah. Scene. Don't yeah. forget yeah. though, he oh. been kidnapped and okay, so, set on fire and all that. I shit. I would never so, think yeah. that for a PBS. That's looking crazy. Sweet. That's like when you when you rob somebody, you typically rob them when they're with people because their guards are down. Yeah. When you're by yourself, you're looking around, you're checking the exits, or you're looking over your shoulder. I am at least. Wow. So when you with someone, your guards down, you're laughing, you're having a good time. Mm-hmm. That's when a nigga sweet, I'm like, oh, get it, run up on you, yeah. real quick. Both of y'all, let me get it. So I always You're was right. thinking like that, and I've always had that mentality. Again, with the survival mentality of I always had to keep my guard up. Yeah, and yeah. so like I would lead, walk in front of her, her hand be back here. She's still close, but I'm leading because I'm scanning. Like, all right, what nigga exactly. gonna try to jump out? Mm-hmm. And who, who I'm gonna have to kill? And she's always like. Stop walking so fast. Can right. I walk in front of you? I'm like, no, you can't walk in front. I need, I need to see mm-hmm. what's going on. Right. Two, I just am shy. I don't want people seeing me. <laughs> At our wedding, bro, I was holding her so tight when it was, was time to so dance. Nervous. Oh my so God, nervous. I was so nervous dancing in front of everybody and everybody looking at me dance. <laughs> that terrifies me, man. Really? I'm a very shy person. I'm very Get shy. Get out. Who that's, knows? That's, that's super that's bashful so unless surprising. he's performing. I've seen your dick so many times. It's, it's wild. <laughs> the threesomes and the trains it's y'all have wild. run. It's, it's like, different. Please, it's I different. can draw where every man. vein is. Hey, man. <laughs> so can <laughs> half of California's <laughs> women. <laughs> You wild, At bro. At sidewalk grass. <laughs> and wild I love how your grass. wife is sitting over there softly saying, as the, the, so can half of California. <laughs> yes, half of the women in California can draw my husband's penis as well. It's nice. <laughs> it's nice. It's so funny because he has his favorite dick pics in his phone oh, yeah. that have been going around for years yeah. and they don't know that they're old. Oh, yeah. Like the new bitches don't yeah. know. No. That this picture was sent to me 12 oh, yeah. years this, ago. This, this, one, this <laughs> 2008. Baby, ask for the number. Oh, okay, Yo, nigga. This is what really made me say I would be a good you know girlfriend. What's funny? <laughs> I sent her a dick pic in like 08, right? No, uh, I sent it to her and we were in, when we were kicking it in 2010. Was this un, was this asked for? Was this unsolicited? It was unsolicited. I've okay. never in my life asked a man for a dick pic. <laughs> okay. But I have a, yeah, a library full remember. of them in my phone somehow. <laughs> so I, I saved the them, pic, guys. And when I sent it to her, um, <laughs> this is how saucy I was. <laughs> saucy. I hit forward on it because I couldn't find it in my phone. I had to go to a message so I sent to another girl. So she saw that it came from somewhere she else. She saw it was forwarded. She was like, who else did you send this to? And I was Thank like, 
I ain't, I ain't said there's nobody else I had to uh, I had to do this. I yeah, he sent, he sent the picture and he said, what do you think? And I said, I'm thinking, why does it say forward on it? <laughs> and then he didn't respond for a really I, I, long man, time. He had to think of a story. He had to think of a I'm story. Like, clearly a used photo, sir. She's the only girl who's ever um, like Realized made me it? stumble in a lie. Like when I've been talking to women early 20s, like I could lie immediately and they'd be <laughs> believing it. She stumped all my lies, bro. Still yes. do. Yeah. I think it's because um, Tangerine has a natural, very condescending oh, yeah. tone. <laughs> oh, yeah. And so it just Me? makes you, it makes you think like, am, am, am I telling the truth? Right. <laughs> am I in trouble? Yeah. Wait, don't know. bitch, I'm grown. Yeah. Right. Why am I no. Mean. You have the same tone, nigga. Yeah, she you definitely have a does. Very accusatory she tone. She definitely so does. I've been told. Ain't no so you've been told. You but it's different it. when you're on the receiving yeah, end. Yeah, we of have it, a though. lot in common. That's exactly but... what I'm trying to tell you. <laughs> Y'all are both Duncan McLeod of the Clan McLeod. Highlander. <laughs> <laughs> that can only be one. <laughs> oh my god. Because for okay. to say some some simple like oh, I forgot what I said. I said something. She was like, "What you mean?" And I was like. Mm. I had to remind myself, oh, this is how this hell for talk. Because mm. I was going to go there with it. I was like, who the fuck you talking Wait. to? Mm. Was that the audio message I sent you? No, we were oh, okay. we were, we were were downstairs in, in the living room. You said, like, what you mean, guys? And I was like, in my mind, who the fuck you talking to? But I was like, she talks like that. I don't mm. know why her talk. And maybe it's an airy thing, very direct, very dry and cut to the point when they're trying to get plans together and and, and all the details. But mm. I, I have to remind myself sometimes, I love this woman. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, I married her by choice. If that was one of those times where <laughs> you, you, know, by choice. You, weren't, you weren't speaking or responding in definites, then I probably was annoyed. No, we were so, we were talking. And I, you I'm sure? Telling, yes. Okay. I'm, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, it was like... Um, um, no, what it was, I was like, uh, I got to host a show. We, it was yesterday. Uh-huh. And he was like, what show you got to host? And I was like, <laughs> keep your distance. Oh, I keep forgetting that today. My week has been so thrown right. off because of the days that I took this week. So my week has been thrown off. I mm. just realized that today was Wednesday and not Thursday. No, but then I thought it was yesterday. I thought yesterday was Monday. My mm-hmm. day's been so screwed up. Did we grab, we missed right. a lunch yesterday. Hmm? Can I grab more cards? Or we Did done? you want to do more? Yeah, let's do some more. Oh. <laughs> He's going to have fun. There's other segments. In the, oh, but, I'm sorry. But, there, there they are. are right. yeah. These cards are Those, why we yeah. are part of the reason why we're in such a great space. Oh yeah, uh, they make us from, ask things. Yeah, that, that we wouldn't. One might not be on like just on our mind, and then two. Oh, we already um, did this one. That we are kind of nervous to even but bring to each other. You didn't do this one. Yeah. But you guys didn't answer it. He answered it. Oh, we're just recycling yeah. the same questions? Oh, no, 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 no. no, no, we don't, no, no, we do, no, we're not doing that. Give I got a different question. Here. Yeah, we get, we or get the, we could get the, the naughty deck. Tangerine wanted to play with oh, the naughty deck. Oh, my God. Deck. All right. Mm-hmm. Which one is so that? I like the real ones. Get, the, okay. get that because I am trapped. I'm sorry. Thank you. But you did it. Thanks for watching the live chat. More mob and Team Tangerine and Team CT all day. What do you call your people, um, Farron? I don't know. They're supposed to come up with something. And I haven't followed up to find out if the they The very did. directs. <laughs> Mrs. More Mobs. Mrs. More Mobs. <laughs> Mrs. Mobsters. What's up, Z-Dog? I don't know. I don't know. Here's the thing, though. If y'all, if y'all saw Farron and her, her real element, like at home, she is a fool. Like, yeah. like you would think it's she was sad. on something because she bounces around the house. Mm. Me and the kid both look at her like, and then <laughs> the kid would get up and start playing one, and I look at them both like, I need to trade these in. <laughs> <laughs> but she model. is on something, right? Because I admire that really, about you, that yeah. you can, like, take stuff and have fun. Like, oh, But leave, I'm usually not when I'm just bouncing around the yeah, house. Yeah, she's just, oh, you she just, just yeah. using her. I'm tonight. just, it's yeah. just my She doesn't energy. drink anymore. It's just what I do. Oh, that's right. You don't drink anymore, which is dope. You know, yeah. we're sober. Yeah. Well, sober implies that I've ever done it. <laughs> Popping everything, <laughs> going, going, going. I'm wilding out out here. Oh, these one. are beautiful cards. These are after so dark. So this is the Ace Metaphor tonight's conversation cards. We've been rocking with these for um, a few, several weeks now. Oh my god. Oh, oh, you okay, baby? Okay. Oh my god. What's well, the matter? My mom ain't there gonna be go. saying this. No, I'm <laughs> sending it to her. No, you're right. not. I'm sending it to her. We're sending it right to her. I'm she like, hey, mama, some my more chicken and spaghetti. I'll show you this video. <laughs> your mama's on your Patreon. My mom? Uh-huh. She yeah. see all my bikini pics, all my lingerie <laughs> shots, <laughs> my celibate <laughs> info podcast. <laughs> well. Okay, Tangerine. Here we are. Oh, okay. Do you prefer to be on top or bottom? Explain. Farron. 
Mm. What would doggy this... style be? What, what would that be? <laughs> right. That's so that's her favorite. You yes. tell me. Yes, um, that is my my favorite. That would be her being on the bottom. No, oh, no. the way somebody, I do it. Yeah, she, she, I said it last night. How do you do doggy style Listen, when you're on the top? Nine years and two thirds of those hey, nine top years. Top means I've you're been, in charge. I've right. That's, that's think of that's what top means. And, and when you the rhythm, I and then take she does charge little, she do this from little thing position. When she throws it back, she's like side to side, like, uh, yeah. uh, uh. Like, <laughs> like she's skiing. Like, like I keep she's telling her. So I, I love time. that. I love that so much. Did you hear <laughs> them? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's when I told funny. him, I was like, yo, is that how I look to you? Because I need to switch it up. She on the slopes with it. I don't like it. Mm-hmm. This is so doggy yeah. style with, with but you in control is yes. what you're saying. Okay, mm, yes. I love that. Interesting. Uh, mm. Do you guys have videos um, available for purchase? <laughs> <laughs> Here's the thing. I've said this before. If we working, if we weren't working with yes. some of our counterparts, like if we didn't have some of the business partners that we had, Kev we on would, stage. Yeah, we would definitely have OnlyFans. <laughs> I we know. definitely. I don't because I don't want any Not of them to, to rub There's off. others. Yeah, this yeah, is yeah, Kev yeah, on yeah. stage. I mean, just just because we're in the studio, we, we brought him. I Tangerine, go to your room. I'm sorry. <laughs> but yeah, we would definitely too much if, truth. If, if yeah, we you know. Oh, now you want my oh, nasty sharing. drink, my terrible drink, my drink that sounds horrible. It's not that bad, but I can definitely tell it's black tea and not anything coffee okay, related. Okay, okay. Anyway, what's up? CT, your car. <laughs> oh, okay, cool. <laughs> uh, what's something you've done sexually that your mom would consider disowning you for? Let me tell you something. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he be smutting these hoes out. Uh, um, <laughs> Mm. He's trying to go through and find the mildest thing that he can yeah. actually talk about. Um, okay, um, your mom's not on my Patreon, baby. Say what you really want to say. Oh, okay. Um, <laughs> was interesting because I remember when we got bootleg cable, uh, I was like 15, and the guy hooked up to porn channels too, right? Mm-hmm. And uh, he tried to block them to where I couldn't get to him or my mom see him or anything. But when he did it, there was a, a video of a woman sucking a guy's dick. Mm-hmm. And my mom was like, oh, oh. That is so disgusting. That is nasty, right? And I remember I was like 22 and that memory popped back up in my head. And I was like, damn, maybe this is why my mom is single because she, she ain't out here, you know what I mean, doing that. <laughs> Which is great, <laughs> you know, because when I get a kiss up on, on my cheek from my mama, I don't have to worry about nothing. But um, something that I think she would disown me for, man, I've done so much. I think <laughs> I don't this think she would is the approve. longest. Of anything, I you know what she but wouldn't approve of. Spit it out. She no. wouldn't approve of me um, having had uh, orgies with women. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Mm, interesting. Apparently, my wife doesn't either. Anyway, so um, <laughs> yeah, the orgies. What are you talking about? The way you looked over, you were like, "No, I was waiting on the rest of the list. The swingers party." Hey, hey, hey! <laughs> hey. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> My bad. Hey. Yeah. Tangerine is me. I love <laughs> getting in people's business. You and it's so wonderful when they volunteer. <laughs> 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 Makes me feel less nosy when they volunteer. <laughs> That's why we're here, right? That's you why you're here. Right. on the show. Absolutely. You know what? With that, we went to one. Oh, look at early. who wants no, to talk Because I need to clear this up. We <laughs> went who's to hella one mouthy? Early. <laughs> uh, you think your mouth on everything? Everybody? No. Oh, not that mouthy? She says. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the show, folks. Shut the fuck up! I hate you, bro. We went to a party once, and um, there was this girl that I wanted, right? And the girl was so on tang, and uh, she was clearly like a lesbian. Mm-hmm. She had the fattest ass, mm-hmm. and she was like, "I want your girl," and I was like, "Oh, we're in a pickle because <laughs> you know, she's not in the girls, and I want the cakes." I'm like, "Maybe we can work something out." I pulled Terrence to the side. I'm like, "Wow, yeah, right?" <laughs> so the girl, you know, tries to come over to Tang. And she, I'm trying to get inside, and she wouldn't arch enough. She was letting me in, but she wouldn't arch her back. Yeah, she didn't want that at all. Yeah. Was she smashing me with a dildo or eating me out? Jesus Christ. Uh, <laughs> I can't remember. She she had her I thing. I swear, yes. That fast is you. Forward, fast that forward is you. to you finding out your mom is on page. <laughs> 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 I'm going to give her a subscription for free for you. I would leave right now. <laughs> Watch out. Uh, that oh, is no. hilarious. Uh, this is not good. <laughs> well, you brought it up. 
<laughs> well, because you said now she's sweet and innocent. Yeah. Right. Oops, I went to St. Bernard right. Catholic High School. Fair enough. Apologize. Go right ahead. The, the, the fake oh. innocence <laughs> Tangerine is exhibiting over there is Hilarious. masterful, Hello. and this bitch should have a master Hello. class. That's how she does it. <laughs> That's how she does it. Oh, okay, my card. The Thomases out here living. You see that? Hey, they. Oh. We don't. <laughs> We don't have drawers full of toys yet, though. We got to oh. get on your level. Oh, oh yeah. my we goodness. We don't have a whole half of the bed. I got my own toys. <laughs> right. <laughs> that's, that's What's different. your best sexual skill in the bedroom and why? What is my best? From your opinion. Mm. Oh, so you want me to ask her? Yes. Oh, okay, cool. Mm. Uh, let's see. I, I, hmm. I love the way you throw it back, but I also like how you like. I get it jump started with like, I, I, my dick always needs to jump. <laughs> a jump? Yeah, you know, you connect the cable, so that head is always a jump. I need. Okay. Oh she my goes god! I, I throw that. I throw that. I throw that dick in that mouth like okay. bowling ball. You throw it. <laughs> he throw it. I do. I he do. throw it. And then that he jumps up. But and what is the go. best? Skill? You is off subject. He Let's... gave you the answer. I, I said. I said. I said the, the back, and then I said the head. Oh, okay, because yeah. I'm like, I just felt like you were about to go on a tangent. That was it. That's all I needed. He mentioned needed. on stage how you screw him. Oh yeah. Yes. Get, he gets screwed. So yeah. No, I said fuck. I was trying not to curse. Why? We, I don't know. Know. we just talked about a swingers party now. You trying not? But swingers isn't flagged. But the f word sometimes, you know, they nah, go through the analytics listen, and be this like, "This is only Whoa. on um, the more my Patreon for now." No, it, it goes, goes live. to it, it goes, goes to live. Yeah, page too. Yeah, oh, it goes that's to page YouTube. Page. You didn't know this? YouTube. Uh, oh. <laughs> and when he puts your name in the title, your mom's gonna find it because she has a Google alert for oh, so everything you're in. So you. And she's gonna see it. <laughs> you said it's alive. I say only for the for the more my. He doesn't. He's not a fan. I'm a more my member. I He's thought you fan. only. Oh, okay. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah. So, um, add for, that to the list of things I need to share before allowing people to sit down at the studio. I thought it, <laughs> thought it was no. I, I thought, thought it, was it was clear. Common knowledge. Yeah, we're we're banking episodes. Oh, yeah. we do. Okay. You okay, baby? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> right. Christmas is gonna be different. Here, like... the holidays yeah. are gonna be a little different <laughs> after mom comes back over <laughs> our house. Mm. I mean, but she if she cooked that spaghetti you, and that chicken, knew, call she your knew boy. it went live and she still goaded you into telling you that story. Know. You a villain, man. I did, how did you not? This is one of your clothes. He was in our wedding. How do you not it's know? He's my brother. He, he, yeah, he, told me, he stopped me last night before I brought him up. He's like, hey, man, don't do none of that best friend shit. I'm your fucking brother. All yeah, right? man. You invite me up as your fucking brother. I was like, okay. Because right. to him, was bring people up. He was like, all right, y'all, we better keep it going. Give it up for this next person. I'm oh like, God, I didn't what? know them. I didn't do. I didn't know them. So yeah. that's why I gave them the generic one. So, yeah. You know, that, I, I would have did point. that like that. That's a great point. Yeah. <laughs> that's a damn good point. Okay. So. Oh, it's my turn? Yes. Is during that time of the month sex off limits? <laughs> 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 If you've known how many red light tickets I've got in my life, man, this car wouldn't even touch my hand. Brother, I hear crime scene. <laughs> crime scene. I'm the reason, original GTA winner. <laughs> <laughs> mm. It's causing havoc in the streets and the sheets. Go to your room. <sighs> oh my God. <laughs> She's okay. like, I'm on my period. He was like, and? <laughs> <laughs> like from the very first, like, our. Er, er, Period don't stop nothing but the senses, day. baby it's girl. Been it's been like, yeah, it's gonna be a light one this evening. <laughs> I'm like, go ahead and just take a shower first. Is the shower slow it up, or ease or something. <laughs> I was, that's, I was, that's not I, how it I, works it's at not, all. Not, but I thought it did. That's what I heard. Soon make it stop. He thinks. Thought it slowed it up. <laughs> that's not how it works. It's at all. funny how they think. They have no idea how it works, so they think it's just constantly dripping until it's yeah. like it's weird. But yeah, <laughs> yeah. it's not like that. Sage Bless their hearts. Me from doing anything mm -hmm. like um. <laughs> Like when it happens, like the times we've done that, mm -hmm. she's like, stay still. <laughs> move your hands up here. And then she'll, you know, we'll do our business. And then she's like, don't move. Oh. And then she'll go get a rag and clean my entire area because she don't. She don't want me to see any evidence. She's oh, like, don't go down. He's like queasy it's a, or something. Yeah, he wouldn't want to see it. Yeah. yeah. But yeah. it feels amazing. Yeah. So he's enjoying himself. Yeah. <laughs> it's, that shit is like a Marvel movie. It's no blood. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, there was no blood in Marvel yeah, movies. I'm the cleaner. That's how they keep it a PG. <laughs> <laughs> it's, they don't, huh? 
Yeah. It's like a Marvel movie. I, I never that's even thought about that. That's that. That. how they keep the ratings with the, with the low blood count. No oh, blood. my goodness. Yeah. So, y'all, I just wanted to um, jump into the topic for today. Thanks for suggesting doing another um, round of cards, though. That Thanks was for giving me some sex topics. <laughs> no problem. No problem. <laughs> I'm a pleaser. Yeah. Um, so, years, I do. Though. What'd you say? I said she is, though. Oh. <laughs> um. Inappropriate. <laughs> Wait, is to hear vouching for me being wow. a pleaser? No. no. Oh, for you. I was like, how do you, sir? <laughs> I've known you well, a long heard, time, but I don't remember. I've, I've, heard, I've heard Clayton's story. So, I mean, <laughs> just, just off of that, my character through him. Okay. Um, yeah, so I just wanted to get into, because I don't know many, if any, couples who, like, share or on the same career path. Mm. And I want to just kind of talk about, I mean, I know y'all, no, you weren't acting yet when y'all met, right? Yeah. Oh, you were? It okay, just, it so wasn't acting. they were acting, it wasn't, but yeah. it wasn't as kind of parallel as it seems to be No, no, now. no. Well, I get what you're saying. Yeah. We, I was mainly doing stand-up. I hadn't booked but maybe a couple of acting roles, but not enough to even call myself an actor. Mm -hmm. And she was prominently already movies right, and TV right, and all of that. Right, right, yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, beautiful. <laughs> I'm listening. <laughs> I'm listening. He said, I'm not his wife, okay? Like, don't. Yeah. Don't get it twisted. That ain't all I am, And all that's right? what bothers me when people introduce me <laughs> yeah. to other people now. When we go out, they're like, yeah, this is Tangerine. It's Clayton's wife. And I'm like, that's it? Because <laughs> right. one, I knew you before I knew him. Right. I knew you before I married him. And I've but also. You know, also, if they're introducing you as Clayton's wife instead of CT, I need to talk to some people. <laughs> you keep changing your name, baby. That is fucking Diddy this over here. This nigga right here with this name change it's, I've, ain't it's gonna one worry. time. No, it's not. I say, yo. No. Hey. It wasn't, it wasn't just that. It wasn't that. What no, was it? it's been like three, baby. It was Clayton. Yeah. Then it was Clayton Thomas. It was you never had, Clayton. you had to say it was, the both together. Clayton was, Thomas, exactly. Clayton Thomas, Clayton, Clayton Thomas. Clayton Thomas never, all together. Yeah, it was only that, mm -hmm. and then CT. And mm. then it became Team, team CT. Clayton Thomas on your pages. Yeah, that's my page. Then mm -hmm. Team CT, and mm -hmm. now it's just the, CT. What do you think and team CT, CT was? is dope. I'm, no, CT is dope. I, 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 got tired of people I, fuck I, it up. I, I don't know who which one of these names filed for bankruptcy first, but that's the only reason to keep changing your name. Through the grace name. of God, none of them. <laughs> it's tough around the house because I don't know what to call them when I'm mad. You know what's funny? The this is when I knew I wouldn't tolerate anybody calling me by my first name. One, I've never liked my first name. Two, my mother calls me CT. Really? Mm, Swear to she God. She does? Wow. Swear to God. And wow. I didn't even tell her it. Mm. Swear so to she God. She watches the she content. Just started, she just started doing it or she like since you were younger? No. Um... Mm. Since she saw him cuss people out on his show <laughs> yeah. for calling him the long name, I'll She's say like, oh, the long CT. name. <laughs> She's over the name that would never be mentioned. <laughs> the artist formerly known. As. Probably the last three years. Mm. Um, but I was like, "Mama, you ain't got all right, whatever." All right, but yeah, my mama. Oh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so who my knows mama your other, who, knows, who knows your other name? Don't do that, bro. Oh, I'm the, the last I'm name. Say, I would right. say yeah, the, the last, last name. name. Um, else know that? I know that one. Only <laughs> the people who are allowed to call me my first name. A very small circle of y'all know. <laughs> and that's that why it took me so long to change my last name. Because when we got married, we put on the license that he was going to drop the last name he didn't like uh -huh. and just go with the one he did. Which and I was going to take the one name. he did. And we were like, bet. Then we got married. Mm -hmm. And we were like, okay, when we get back from the honeymoon, let's go take care of all the name changes. Then he changed his mind about mm. dropping it because his dad died. Mm -hmm. He didn't want to leave it. I'm like, that'll do it. I was like, that'll do it. My dad died the year before we got married. I'm still about to drop his name. So you're right. you are a woman. It's evil. So what? Oh. We both mean? had a deal. I'm sorry. Just do you not because, know how marriage works? <laughs> no, just because that's not what nowadays. traditionally yeah, happens some people doesn't taking, mean that's what has to happen just yeah. because she's you a woman. You can't lean on tradition when y'all have an unconditional. I knew you were going to say that. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Right. I'm just saying. Number one, I wasn't even going to go that route. I was going to go the route of C. Diddy. she's the one <laughs> uh -huh. that wanted to take my last name. I told her she shouldn't even have a last name. Your na your first name is so strong. You I've should just be known as Tangerine. Mm. Never mm -hmm. heard you say these words. I said this sorry. when I first met you. I was like, your last name is because her first I've, last name was Martin. I was like, your last name is Martin. I thought you were just Tangerine. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but yeah, you like how I'm a friend that'll call you out on some shit? I, I ain't gonna it. be. I ain't gonna be your yes man. I never <laughs> wanted you to be. You, I, you, you know I never will be, child. <laughs> Not child. <laughs> The auntie hips kicked in. Child. Child. Hey, what did we say? We was Not the auntie. Yeah, child. They, um, mm. 
Nah, they said they didn't got Dylan out of jail. Why does the hand? Why does the hand go up and you start? Because that's just trying, trying to keep from getting upset. Yeah. yeah. I know they ain't gonna ask me for no money to bail them out. Cause I seen them down there selling that though. Mm-hmm. Hey, Amen. <laughs> so. Um, what was that like being in, in that dynamic? Actually, starting off that way with From the Sounds of It, Tangerine, you were more um, successful and more established mm-hmm. than... He um, said, mm-hmm. <laughs> ...that CT was at the time. How did, how did y'all operate in that space? Well, she asked you. I think it was... I think it was helpful for him at first because oh, yeah. I was able to... Ooh. <laughs> I was able to help him help give me a career gain financial stability because mm-hmm. you know we all told the story that when I met him he had roommates and he had an air mattress and all that but it was a dope air mattress though <laughs> yeah it was very tall it was very bed bed yeah. height um, you think it's a real bed so you sat on it all right, and we right. shot our first sketch together on that bed because mm-hmm. yeah. he had invited me over and for whatever reason I went um, <laughs> not even realizing that he was trying to smash I was just like oh yeah let's make some content but I wasn't trying to smash that day you were. That you, day. you said, because you took me to Cuckoo Roo Chicken, you thought for sure because I bought you something to eat, you were going to give me something. Yeah, I'm, I'm from like, Detroit. I don't if I need buy you to something chicken. to eat, what's up? Yeah, so you were trying to smash, but <laughs> I was trying to make content. But I think it helped because I was able to do things for him, like show him, you know, how to audition, how to network, how to thank people when you book a job and send a, send something sweet to them. Or how she taught to, me the game. Yeah, mm-hmm. how to build, um, how to keep relationships and, and nurture them. And how to have an IMDb page, how to have mm-hmm. a website. Like I taught, I taught him all that stuff. And now that I'm doing stand up, he's doing that for me. Mm. Like, you know, this is how oh, you develop this, a joke or this yeah. is what you need to expect when you go on the road or different things like that. And I think that's why he so loves paying all the bills for us now, because at there was a time where he would order something to eat and then step to the side for me to come up with my card and pay. And I was like, <laughs> why? My mom would be so disappointed in me right now <laughs> for taking care of this man. But it, it's, it's worked out great because yeah. he didn't do the thing where you get successful and leave your first lady and go to the white girl or whatever. Mm-hmm. He just stayed with me, and mm-hmm. now he supports us. Mm-hmm. Was awesome. a blessing. Um, <laughs> she taught me everything about the small things that mm-hmm. you need to know in this business. And um, I think because of her and being able to form that knowledge and gain a career helped us tremendously. And then it's kind of like the hand that keep reaches back. It's like she's ahead in this race, and she grabs me, and it's like, okay, cool, I got something. Here we go. Launch you. Yeah. And then, mm-hmm. Yeah, pulling yeah. each other along. So do you think that was the saving grace that one of you were a little ahead of the other? That's the only secret. You In your relationship, if you guys are in entertainment, somebody has to be further than the other. If it's the blind leading the blind, y'all won't succeed because y'all don't know what to do. Y'all going to get frustrated and not know how to pull each other up. Mm. And if one person is ahead, then that continues to keep things fresh. Like, mm-hmm. I need to be able to learn from somebody. And I also need to be able to teach, right? Mm-hmm. So for us, a turning moment was the internet. Mm-hmm. When I got online and started making content, I was able to teach, and she saw me figuring it out. And then it's like we started just continuing, going, going, going. Now she got her thing, I got mine, um, and we still have our acting and every other thing that we do. Okay. But y'all both can't be blind leading a goddamn blind. <laughs> That's right. Farron just made. Farron has been doing really well at like linking out, uh, reaching out to companies and getting becoming brand ambassadors mm. or, or doing marketing partnerships and things like that. And she just got her first Zelle deposit. Yay! Uh, first Actually, second. Pink. That was my, my second, second one. Second with Pink Hips, man. Um, that was the first with Pink Hips, but the other one was um, Vagesty. So that was hey. my second. That's v- vaginal? Yeah. Um, Vagesty is the name of the company, but yeah. I was feminine asking, is it hygiene? Vaginal? Yes. Yeah. It sounds I mean, it's okay. Vagesty. It's what not going to be I love for it. your arm. Uh, suppos- not suppository. Shut the hell no, up. No, they okay. do all around oh, health exfoliator, feminine wash, um, an oil. What else? Oh, the um, boric acid suppositories. Acid. They they have lube, but they have all the all the things. Get that one like us. Hell. Get the, Yeah, get we want to learn brand um, deals from you guys off off the air. I know nothing. Yeah. Well, you I know got... what? I just really applied. I mean, I guess it not. I guess it was definitely helpful coming from corporate. Be it's mm. and coming from philanthropy mm. because I've had to reach out, yeah, basically and get money. cold call people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To open up conversations for mm. a really long time, and so it was like nothing to me to like draft a template and then was like, okay, shooting this off to these companies, mm. let it marinate, see who I hear back from, send some follow ups, let it marinate. 
take these people off the list, add some more people. Like, so I wasn't overwhelming myself, but yeah. still getting it done and keeping a nice rotation um, going in. So, so Monday I so can sit fun. down with you. <laughs> I'm putting it in my calendar. We'll be over sure, to the house. Sure, yeah, we'll sure, some sure. Stuff when we come over to the house. Okay. Oh yeah. I'm very glad to see you doing everything with um, social media and just opening up because yeah. your personality has been dope for years and people just had nobody known. knew. Thank nobody you. knew. Was she was dope on the low. Imagine, <laughs> wasn't sharing nothing yo, with nobody. What if well OnlyFans wasn't out? Just going back to the callback you said earlier, OnlyFans wasn't out. But what if when you were thicker, you were doing like the bikini pictures and the brand deals for that mm. then. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Man. I would have been on her coattails. <laughs> Proudly. Man. Proudly. I just wasn't in the in the head space to to get there. I'm yeah. much I'm in a place now where I'm like very confident and sure of who I am. At mm. that point, moving across the country and trying to navigate and learning yeah. how to be a friend and make Friends and family have friends. out here, I, I and just trying to learn, learning how to people and I find didn't, myself. I didn't know was, that myself. Was difficult. She only hung with her family. Yeah. Mm. So making friends outside of the people living with you or around the corner I had was no very difficult for her. Yeah. Nigga, she wasn't fucking with the group when you when you brought her. Uh, he brought her fresh off the fucking St. Louis boat. Yeah. Well, and she wanted to like, fuck. He's That's, like, yo, yeah, we hadn't seen each other for a couple weeks, and so she was hey, like, man. "This is nice," but. We got I was it. not expecting to walk into a house full of people. I'm like, nigga, we ain't seen each other in how long? And you just walked me into a house. He was excited. Full of people. It's for a birthday, too. You know what I mean? So, you know. Off a plane? All I wanted to do was fucking take a nap. And take a nap. I love that order. And we did I that. love that order. We did that right after that order. But Tedra picked up on it, and she got on the side of me just dancing. Girl, let me get these niggas out your house. <laughs> <laughs> I know what I would want when right. I just got off the plane. See, she got Damn. it. She was like, girl, <laughs> get these niggas. I love my dance. Right. <laughs> but I you were dancing the mirror. entire time. You were there. Like, every time I saw her, she was... <laughs> I love to dance. That's how you know at this birthday, yes. I was sleepy. That's I was why sitting I came down. up to you. I was like, You're like are I'm you surprised. okay? You sitting down. You I was right? sleepy. <laughs> mm. I had a long you week. you never pass up a chance to, to get hear on always dance floor. speaks so highly of you and spoke highly of you it was like a Christmas present seeing you I'm like <gasps> and you're like mm. <laughs> I'm like what's going on hi strangers <laughs> cause here's the thing now now that we are building you know the business mm-hmm. and getting clients and stuff like that like when we're at the spot that we hang out at on Tuesdays I'm like, hey, these people are new. I haven't met them. This or this. Can you make some rounds? And she's like, cool, I got it. Boom. Hey, what's up, y'all? How y'all yeah. about? It's like now she yeah. she understands the importance of networking, networking. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Right? Yeah. and meeting mm-hmm. people and, and and nurturing those relationships. Mm-hmm. And you know, she understands it now, but she wasn't in that mindset prior to. Mm-mm. And so no. her sisters have best friend, they talk every day, and then mm-hmm. there's the kid. Yeah. So, like, that was it for her, and that was enough for her. So, but that also, and I've never actually never talked about this. Ooh. Well, no. Exclusive. This, <laughs> that put a lot of pressure on me mm-hmm. to be her husband and her uh, everything else. Oh, yeah. yeah. Of course. Of which, course. Which, which was very yeah. difficult because, one, I'm a loner. Yeah. I can love you. And I can be great well, on the we surface. we have never discussed that. Yeah, yeah but... because I I became like super dependent mm-hmm, on you. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And yeah, that's yeah. why it was also so difficult for her to understand, like, I need some weekends away. Mm. Yeah. Like, I, I got to get a weekend to myself so I can reset. Because I the way I process things when I'm thinking about problems or my next step or how I want to attack my next goal, I need silence. I need to be isolated. And when she's around, because I know her love language is physical touch and words of affirmation, she needs this. She mm. needs I'm physical the touch intimacy. Too. Really? Yes. And I can't, I can't effectively do both. Mm-hmm. I can't focus on what I need to focus on and, and plot my next plan and give you the attention you know that you those, need and deserve. Those reels that go around and it's the women and they show that guy walking by without touching their booty. And I'd be like, that'd be me. Like, wait, you just passed by me. You oh, didn't touch that me. That means you're mad at me. You that means there's a problem. Mm-hmm. Yes, you no, didn't. And, then, and, and literally, literally, she would go from that to like, "What's wrong? Do we need to talk?" Exactly. Like, mm-hmm. yes, you better I'm brush up against me. You better things. do How something. How are we gonna pay more? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, and, and you know, we, I, we talked about this in one episode. We were so broke at one time. 
but I, you know, still wanted to do something sweet. So she was at work. She came home. I had the kid in the white shirt, and she, I drew on this little, mm-hmm. little thin ass <laughs> mustache. Mustache, like and, she was a mariachi. And she look. met her at the door. And she gave her the menu, and the menu said tacos, tacos, tacos. And the name of the restaurant was tacos, tacos, tacos. And all we saw was tacos. And she at the table. But I got the mariachi music playing you in had the kitchen. The kid come up to me to take my order. And That's was so like, cute. And it was all tacos. What would tacos. you like to eat? And I was like. What would you suggest? <laughs> <laughs> That's so and cute. She was like, so she so was so like so the so taco. <laughs> 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 Oh, that's awesome. That's awesome. Tacos, tacos, tacos. And the restaurant was called Tacos. It was so cute. It was so cute. Can I get a salad? That's a Me only got Caesar. (laughs) Right. (laughs) That's another joke for Jamaica. I'll tell you about that one. That's what I love. My my love language is physical touch and quality time. Mm -hmm. And his is acts of service. And words of affirmation. So I have to, you know, I have to do stuff for him, bring him his play, bring him his juice, tell him how Make amazing he is, tell him how funny he is. <laughs> Let me, so, side note, ever since he posted that reel and we talked to you and you made fun of him for not making the bed, mm-hmm. I went out of town for a week. We talked. And he sent a picture every day he made the bed. Aww. Every single day. And you know now. What? Make your mama so proud. <laughs> And now he helps me make the bed. When we get up in the mornings, we both do a half, like we did in the beginning of the relationship. Uh, yes. yep. And you know what? Uh, I love that. I love that my yes. brother is stepping up. He's been iron sharp as iron, man. It feels good. And we that only go, we only gross. get better by we calling each other out. That's I that's what I do love about our relationship. I don't have time for that. I'm set in my ways. No, yeah. you're not. Yeah, you're not. But giant. a person, when you care, you do stuff like that. Yeah, I love it. Mm-hmm. And he likes he the pride of finishing the bed and sending yeah. me or showing me. And I'm just like, and it feels good. The room looks better. Yeah. And then you can go on with your day. Also, yeah. I'm. Oh, I think this is a, a. I don't know if it's a age thing or just like a man thing, but like I'm someone that I don't want to have to think. Mm-hmm. Right. Tell me what you want. Mm-hmm. If you tell me what you want. I will do that. Mm-hmm. Everything that she tells me she wants, I do. Mm-hmm. About 95%, mm-hmm. I do it. That five, it's like, hey, baby girl, you got to take that L. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I, so sometimes you just got to let shit go. Because you know I mean? I'm doing every other thing you want. I'm giving yeah, yeah. you everything you ask for. Stall me. So what I was going to say is because yeah. my love language is physical touch and quality time, well, that might not even be related. One thing I noticed is that when we were dating and he didn't have money, we did a bucket list of um, things because he just wanted to come over and hang and kick it so he could smash. And I'm like, no, we have to do fun stuff. So we had a bucket list and part of it was free stuff and part of it was stuff that you could do for 20 bucks and then part of it was like over 50. Oh, I remember you talking about this at the wedding reception. Yes, so it made us be creative and do things together. And then when we actually... Um, would do uh, celebrations that he didn't have any money. He would make me a card, like a big poster board, and draw fun stuff on it and sign with his nickname. He did all this creative stuff, like the tacos, tacos, tacos. That's the kind of stuff that I remember and would love mm-hmm. is the stuff he did when he was broke. Now that he has money, he's hey. just like, send me the link. What you want? <laughs> and he'll just pay for it, and yes. then he won't wrap it. He'll just give it to me yeah, in whatever bag it came yeah. in and be like, yeah, happy birthday. Yeah, Merry Christmas. <laughs> And I'm like, I appreciate that you can afford to give me that, but you can you give me a note? You used to write these really amazing notes, and Aww. you used to tell me how you felt. And and now it's just like, yeah, you want another iPhone? Okay, cool. You want another computer? Okay, cool. It's all. It's, yeah, it'll be here I tomorrow. Get it. I get it. The ease and simplicity of just clicking and, and taking yeah. care of that is it is also gratifying. In our point, it, it's a a coming of time, a coming of age type of experience. But I always think about you got to do what you did to get her to keep her. And that always rings in my mm-hmm. head when I feel like I'm off my rocker. Like, we just was talking about this yeah. last weekend, this past weekend. And uh, I shared with you guys, you might want to do it too. I was telling her, I was like, because we role played before, like, went out, met up, mm-hmm. and act like we met in the club or something like that. Love it. But uh, I was telling her, I was like, we should role play like we're dating. And somebody stay at a hotel for a couple of days or however long it takes for you, like, to get invited back. So over the course of three to five days, like y'all just be texting, talking on the phone, all that type of stuff, really dating. Mm. And then on the day that, and you don't have to force it or, or rush it. You was like, hey, would you come back to me? And then the the, the whole thing would be over. But yeah. so for those cute. three to five yeah, days, so you just cute. like just so date I that volunteer person. to leave. He can be the single parent this oh, time. Fuck. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> We're the kid gonna be eating the fuck out. <laughs> but then he wants to fire the trainer. Mm. Oh yeah. I just said that I'm not gonna be eating. You know I'm I'm locked in now. <laughs> that um to that yeah. point, her saying these things, she wanted the handwritten cards, all of that. I had got on that train for a bit, and then one day I was like, look, I understand. 
Mm-hmm. You like that stuff. You like that guy. I got to be honest with you. I'm not him. I'm no longer him. So if you want to get to know me, let's get to know me as this guy now. Mm-hmm. And she was like, all right, but can you still incorporate some of that guy into this? And I said, yes, because mm-hmm. I didn't want to continue chasing 24-year-old me. Mm-hmm. I'm like, look, I understand it, but I'm he, I'm this dude now. He changed. Yeah. <laughs> well, and I mean, I'm not rich. Nobody, I need no, nobody gets money and saves. I mean, yeah, saves. Let's say, Man, we, nobody all have, we, all, we all have. We all need your subscription on our various Patreons. <laughs> <laughs> Patreon.com slash T A N J A R E. I do want to wrap up this part. Um, I'm not leaving, so you can wrap up, but we're going to stay. Are you going to stay for another one for real? Because our next one starts. Yeah, our next one's going to start, and I was trying to respect y'all time. Yeah. What is it? Y'all got other guests? Y'all holding on? No. Have the, it was just going to be the, the two of us talking about a different subject, but since I didn't get as far in this one, I can just continue this yeah, conversation. All right, so, so when are we doing our podcast? In an hour. Our this podcast hour? starts at three. All right. We got to go. <laughs> <laughs> Keep them on track. <laughs> and then also, my sister just gave birth to my nephew yeah. yesterday, oh, and I'm baby, going, baby after did. this podcast and our podcast, I'm driving an hour to go see my new nephew. Yeah. Aww, yeah. And then visiting baby. hours are over at six. <laughs> oh, girl, so he, you on the tight. Yes, he's yeah. doing the most. Right. He knows all this. He forgot. It's not my baby. He's, he's, <laughs> he's, he has your memory. Like I said, I right. have to remind him we have plans. Yeah. Well, it's listen, not my baby. It's, it's your not response? my baby. <laughs> we got to get y'all back because, <sighs> yes, yes. like, so. honestly, we could literally do a whole hour of the cards and everybody. I, 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 I think yes. that would be I think yes, that would be. We'll, we'll, do it. we'll do it again. Yeah, All right, we should do it again. We're going to make it a thing. I'm down. We're going to do fun. Let's plan it within a month and we get you guys back. Yeah. And then we'll make that happen because we do We got to keep it. And then we come back. Uh, really I want to like touch y'all. back on that topic because I have some other questions for you guys. Which, Which topic? So, um, just having a couple that's on the same. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. We yeah. talked about how you started, and I want to know about about now. Mm-hmm. And, and oh, that's gonna be a good reason such. to come back. So um, yeah, we're Stay gonna tuned. we're gonna finish ask it. me almost anything. <laughs> almost, almost anything. <laughs> I will ask you anything. You can answer whatever you no, choose. No, because whenever somebody gets asked a question and they don't answer, you be like, you assume the worst. Yeah, just go to that's the on other. you. Because nah, I will man. tell the person in a minute, I'm not answering that. Mm-hmm. Like mm-hmm. my well, own sister, it was something that I didn't want to share with her, and mm-hmm. I was like, that's not important. The <laughs> basic. <laughs> and she was like, can I ask specifically what happened? Mm, that's beside the point. You're missing that's the relevancy the of the point. story. So <laughs> that's let me. The point. Um, and, and she's I, your and best I still friend. Never told her. She she's still does not friend. know to this day. Oh wow! <laughs> Good to know. Fair, you know fair what? As a vault. I, I really fair am. It's fair as a but vault. it was more so. Um, I had just did something that embarrassed the shit out of me, and I didn't want to admit it. Oh, mm. that's honest that's to honest. even say. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's big of you. Yeah. Well, listen, man. Thank you guys so much for watching another episode of More to the Story. We want to thank yes. our special guest, CT. And Tangerine, Tangerine Thomas for Thomas. coming out. Make sure you follow them on all social what media is platforms. That's the thing you've been doing. Uh, he does it all the time, too. He does it even when he's on Zoom. Uh, <laughs> you guys want to tell them where they can find you at and also drop your Patreon so they can subscribe? Patreon slash CT is dope. Um, thank you so much for having us, Absolutely. man. I'm very honored. I'm very grateful. Farron to hear you guys are amazing. Thank you. So are yeah, you. we don't have a lot of couples we can hang out with and do double dates with. So we love when we went to your house recently and like got to hang out. We're like, yay, another couple and they're cool. <laughs> you can hang out. Yes. yes. <laughs> if you know how to spell my name, it's Tangerine, not spell like the fruit. It's T-A-N-J-A-R-E-E-N. I'm on all social media platforms. And my Patreon is obviously just Tangerine, T-A-N-J-A-R-E-E-N. I don't really use my last name on the sites because how many other Tangerines do you know that spell yeah. the name like this? That's and I see true. Z-Dog says he enjoyed this and he's going to start following you now to hear. Yay. Thanks for team, team Reed for pulling up in the Patreon. Yay, I have OnlyFans as well. Same content on it. So don't look for me to be nude. It's just... It's God just damn right, Shane, nude. <laughs> but if we ever break day. up or if he makes me mad, stick ah! around. Ah! OnlyFans.com. And then we'll be niggas waiting around for that. <laughs> oh, as always, guys, up to hear more. Oh, Z Dog still spelled your name wrong. Try again, friend. Um, <laughs> oh, he left off the A. No, but he knows how to spell it because he corrected somebody else earlier in the chat. Yeah, I they know. They know how to spell it. Yeah. Thank you, guys. Um, What's up, Maui? <laughs> See y'all next week. Kiera, Napalm, Simone. <laughs> <laughs>